Uh, hello everyone and welcome to Ship Graveyard Simulator. Um, so my OBS isn't displaying properly, but I'm really hoping it uh, shows up for you guys the right way. Because I've already stopped one recording because of that. But, <clears throat> yeah, just another day. Uh, that crate looks pretty close. Probably because we are on a massive ship. Like, look at all of this. Wow, look at that. Probably get a crate in here with like that. Yeah, clean it up just a, just a little bit. All this stuff off of it. No, but, um, I got the DLC for this, um, the Warship DLC, and this was the biggest ship that they had. Whoa. Yeah, like I said, we're pretty close to the cranes. Barely had to lift it up. But, like, watch how, I don't even know if I'll be able to make this, but, yeah, like, look how long that is. Look how big this thing is. The Russian icebreaker ship. I uh, can't remember exactly what it was. It was in the other recording. Um, but yeah. Thinking about it, I believe I'm going to do a little test and just stop this recording too and see if uh, the other one was okay or see if this one's okay. I'll just pause this one and do that. Excuse me, guys. I just want to make sure. Alright, so yeah, I just went back and checked the other recording that I had started. Yeah, we're good. Let me get back settled in. We're settled back in. Nope. Just needed to click in the window. Alright. But... Yeah, no, my OBS is just weird. The display is not popping up properly, but I'm very excited to get into this and deconstruct every single bit of the ship. Like, when I say deconstruct every single bit, like, even these little floor panels right here, there will not be a single one left over. This is going to be fun. And I hope you'll stick around for the journey with me. Commentary might not be the best, but I'm always here for a chat. Oh, just fell. It's unfortunate. But no, we need to get back to the top so that we can just deconstruct this thing from the top down. It'll probably be the best course of action. And this probably isn't gonna happen in this one video. I can I can guarantee that. <laughs> But if you want to see this massive thing essentially turn to rubble, this this is your type of video. Right. So we'll get started. And nothing really special about the game. Literally just stuff like this. Deconstruction. All these little nodes you have to hit. Um, I will show you this one thing. I do like how it's like realistic in a way. So I've separated this one tile. I have to break it. And then below that, well, it already fell through, but there's a secondary uh, flooring below that. Which is this... This one's roof. Oh, we have containers in here. Yeah, I never really did explore the inside of it. It's in the way here. Oh, Hello. nothing. Awesome. Nope, we don't have any of those. 
I love how we can just walk through and pick up command centers and filing cabinets. It all just works out. I just gotta figure out where you parked your truck. There it is. And Kobe. Yeah, that green arrow tells me that I was gonna always make it into there. You have the blue arrow, which you can control and then throw your stuff. And then you have the green arrow, which tells you exactly where you're gonna hit. Yep. Oh, yeah, we still have to go up. All right, start deconstructing. Yeah, we can start over here. Yeah, there's not going to be any picking this one up. None of that. Have to get the crane for that one. Was I working on this? Looks like I was. Probably doing that before I ended the uh, last recording that I had started. Probably what that is. Anywho, um, I hope you guys will stick around with the journey or at least fast forward, watch your favorite parts. Um, I'm sure I'm just going to put all of this in times two speed and I'm just talking for no reason. But if you want it long form like this, uh, be sure to like and subscribe. Let me know. Comment. Uh, and yeah, we can just take this ship apart together. I think I'm gonna sort a couple of my things and then go pay for an upgrade. Depending if I have the funds. I don't think I do. But I will just stick with what we got. Any more. Oh, we have an electrical box in there. Whoop, not what I wanted to do. Yeah. Then we can just go over here and shut this panel off. Now, don't worry, that is not the only power source in this place. The last ship that I did, um, I had a power source. Like, I had turned off every single box, but there were still charged nodes. And if the node is charged, you can't really hit it, so you get hurt if you hit it. Um, so I had to put these charges on it. Uh, where is it? There it is. Explosives. I had to do that blow it up. Didn't really want to do that, but do what you do. Do what you gotta do. 
Thank you for the TV. Cheers. And now we're just supposed to hold. Well, that is unfortunate. Yeah. Truck on the side? Yeah. <laughs> We're cool. No, but I'm extremely excited to get started on this. And I think... I don't know which side I should start because I don't really want to start in the middle and go down. But, I mean, honestly, it doesn't matter truly where we start because it's all going to get destroyed the same. Well, actually, if you destroy the bottom, all of it's going to fall. And then you lose all of this stuff, all that breaks, and you can't really use it anymore. So it does matter, but it also doesn't. See if we can go ahead and get this. Oh, and then you have contracts up in the top right. Oh, that person actually needs steel. Okay, okay. Cool. Yeah, typically uh, they don't really want the low alloy steel, but that person does. A leak, a leak, is what I'm gonna call him. A bar element. What is that? Oh yeah, my character is like super athletic for whatever reason. And these spots right here where I have to cut, I don't, luckily. Um, all I have to do is break this, and they fall. No cutting required. start in the back and work my way up. So, to the very back. Alright, so then we turn this on and get a feel for where this ends. So this ends right here. So let me just go ahead and break all these. Alright, well, I think we're going to do my favorite thing in this entire game. You remember how I said if I broke everything from the bottom, it would uh, fall? Well, it would be essentially a large-scale version of what I'm about to do, which would probably destroy my computer.
Hopefully it's all disconnected up there. Oh. Yeah, there we go. Give me one second. Look something up real quick. Yes, never mind. Ah, dang it. All right, well, we got that first little part done. Go us. Now we just have to keep working our way all the way down. Then we'll disconnect this real quick, actually. to destroy all of the floor here. That's cool too. That works out. Yeah, I don't. Oh, too far. I don't think my PC is a fan of kind of all this free debris.
Ain't no way. <laughs> I almost. got that shit. Go me. Excuse the language, but go me. Alright, so... What was that? Low alloy steel 5 grams, and he wants 235 thousand. I'm sure there's more than enough of that in here. We got it. We still have to do all of that. Okay. Destroy all the floor up here. Yeah, because wasn't it? Yeah, it was right here and then. Yeah. There you go. No, uh, but yeah, y'all, y'all get the gist of it. It's a nice <laughs> little flow state game. Um, don't really want to cut y'all off, but I also want to play YouTube in the background and uploading a YouTube video with another YouTube video in it. It's <laughs> typically not a smart move. Oh, look at that, weak. And I know I'm providing no commentary, because, unfortunately, if I don't have background noise, I'm not, not really intuitive to say anything, because I'm more or less stuck in my head. So, I do believe I'm going to end this video here. I might, I'm not going to might, I am going to still play this game. Uh, but hopefully if you guys enjoy it, and if you do want to see me, uh, do more of this, just let me know by leaving a comment. Uh, thank you guys so much for sticking around for as long as you did. Alright, bye-bye.